Okay, hey everybody, how's life treating you? I'm Russ Robo, and welcome to Jurassic World Evolution for the third time. First I had to turn off all the copyrighted music, then I had to turn down the graphics because apparently my um, freaking beast of a machine just doesn't want to use its RAM today. But uh, for the third time, let's try to get into new game. I've been pretty excited about this game since, uh, since it uh, was first talked about being uh, released. And I've already seen this, but maybe you haven't. Oh, Hello. God. May I say welcome? My name is Dr. Ian Malcolm. You may have heard of me. Well, correction, you should have heard of me, especially now that you're here. So that frame rate, though. Islands, that frame rate. You need to manage, if you can. The five deaths. Jeez, if only, if only there had been five. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I, I, I missed that part. I told a joke like he said, um... Okay, this is as good a place as any to begin. Isla Matanceros. It's relatively stable. Yeah, you can uh, you can get your feet wet here, and you should. Just diving into the deep end of the pool is where the big, angry, hungry things are. <laughs> and uh, you want to be ready before you try that. <laughs> Speaking from experience, of course. Now, as far as I know, I'm not sure, but this might be a bit of a tutorial. Because uh, this is the first time I've tried playing it. I, it just seems like it's lagging so badly. I don't know if it's just me recording it or what might be going on in the background that might be causing that. I set the graphics to lowest, and it's still pretty bad. I'm Cabot Finch, public relations and crisis management, and I'm here to help you. Sure you are, there, big guy. Sure you are. You'll start by building a Hammond creation lab. And what if I refuse? Oh, God. Okay, so that's how you control the camera there. We've already started on an enclosure for you. Have you You now? should just attach it to the side. But watch out for dinosaurs. Ah, <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> you think you're funny, Mr. Man. Well, you're not funny. You're not ha-ha funny. So this is the enclosure they built. Oh, sorry, I keep covering my mic. They, this is apparently the enclosure they built for me, and I'm supposed to attach it somewhere here? Oh, oh wait. Oh, so it needs to go a little bit through it. Okay, I can get that. I, I'm down with that. I'm down to clown with that. Oh, wow. Dang, that builds up fast. What you're here to do, which is create dinosaur facilities on the islands we call the Five Deaths. Actually... Las Cinco Muertes, <laughs> because Spanish is the lingo of choice around here. Okay. Okay. Now those guys are going in fast forward. They're really building that building. Eleven hot throbbing frames per second. <laughs> Ten frames. Oh You'll wow. You need to connect <laughs> it to the pre-existing network of paths and the power grid. Uh, maybe I just need to defragment my computer. It's having trouble. Okay, we got some paths here. Let us get... Um, so it just needs to be from this building to... The, oh, 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 oh. Oh! Okay. So it's got to start there. Do I hold it down? Uh, do I click it? Drag and drop? No. Wait, wait, come on. Okay, how about that? Yes? No? Maybe? Oh! Oh, now I can go wherever I want with it. You click it once, and then you can fiddle with it all you like. Well, let's make them a 90-degree angle here thing. Yeah, that'll do. That'll do, pig. Now comes the real test. Oh, Incubating oh. a dinosaur. You'll start with a Struthiomimus. Select the creation lab and pick a hatchery bay. There's enough genome data for your first viable dinosaur. Really now? Okie dokie. So, the genome lab. Which one be that? Oh, okay, so it was just the building that I had just created. Which didn't seem like the creation lab to me, but oh, okay. <laughs> Incubate dinosaur. Uh, Struthiomimus. So, wow, Ceratosaur. In Edmontosaur. Edmonto. Edmontosaurus. Triceratops. I, I'd like to make that a challenge to see if I can pronounce all the names. So, incubate. 
Awesome. And uh, I guess eventually I can of the ambitious, start undoing extinction, modifying the genome. With nature's laws. What can possibly go wrong? Mm hmm. Come on, Doctor. Well, all right. You know we've learned so much and invested even more in our Jurassic operations since the last time. Oh, he, he's going pretty fast. Yes, Mr. little guy. Finch, yes, the the last time. There's always a last time, and a next. I probably should have practiced uh, before I went right into a let's play, but I wanted to give it a good, fair shot of my first experience. And I, I have no idea what I'm doing. Release. Oh yeah, that's right. They come out. We get to watch him come out. He runs around. Isn't he cool? Life. I like him. Begins the most precious moment, the result of incalculable actions and reactions, trials and errors, genetic mutations and unknowable combinations, chaos, all leading to a living, breathing, thinking being, an entity, distinct and unique, and now we, you, just manufacture them. <laughs> So, well done, I guess. <laughs> okay. <laughs> he seems so disappointed. Okay, so I'm in the free camera now. So does that mean I'm kind of like follow in follow mode for my dinosaur? I'll get you a drink of water there, champ. Okay, so ground camera. Show dinosaur statistics. We've got ourselves the STR001. Well, that just won't do. Um, he is drinking. He's healthy. He's got his health, food, water, comfort, grassland, forest, and population, and social. So does it tell us what each one of these is? Hmm, not quite yet. But we will find out eventually. And I can rename him. Your name shall be... I probably spelled that wrong. Your name's going to be the incorrect spelling of spaghetti. Whoa! It just shot me out of the camera. Hello? Oh! The Hammond Foundation More massages. has three main areas of interest. Security, entertainment, <laughs> and science. I've okay. already nudged the heads of each division to reach out to you personally. They'll offer opportunities and incentives for you to be part of their team. Choose one of their contracts. It'll help you develop your facility. Awesome. Uh, from what I've seen online, it seems like uh, whenever people play it, there's a lot of uh, talking already. Like, the NPCs talk constantly. And I don't know why I always... For some reason, I always make my voice higher whenever I'm doing a Let's Play. I don't, I don't know why that is. I get excited, I guess. But that's, like... Okay, so... Does it tell me what you do after this contract... You can undertake more work for any division. Request additional contacts from the control room. But does it tell me... Oh, ah, crap. No. Hey, I'm Isaac. I've been hearing good things about you. I'm in charge of the entertainment division here. Okay. Construct power. What good is the world's oh. greatest show if no one sees it? Don't answer. That's rhetorical. I'm not That's stupid. painfully obvious. What I'm saying is that we need people in our parks. Fill up our facilities with warm bodies. Numbers bring <laughs> revenue, excitement, and opportunities. Well, so did I already pick him now? Oh, see, there it goes again. Um, let's see, build, connect, and power an expedition center. Construct power and connect an expedition center to your park's bath network. An expedition center will allow you to send out dig teams across the world in search of dinosaur fossils. Ooh, so I can, I can, I can go back, right? I can go, I can go select one of the other guys. Can I do that? Can I do... Except... Contracts can be requested from the division heads inside the control room. Complete these to increase your reputation and gain additional revenue to keep expanding your park. Okay, okay. Operations... Expedition Center... Ooh, that's, that's getting expensive. That's getting a wee bit high there. I wonder why they're... I bet you can rotate it. Rotate left, rotate right. Doot. Boop, 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 doot, doot, doot. 
Uh, let's see, space, toggle, angle, snap, or place. What is that? Oh. I don't know what that means. What? 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 No. Yeah, that's right. I want to free ro freely rotate it. Firmly grasp it. Boom. Build that so up real one fast. One more thing. Your reputation. Your rep, quote unquote. Keep an eye on it, okay? If you have a solid reputation with a division, you're more likely to benefit from them. Financially, I mean. But, like life, it's a balancing act. Each division is vying for your attention, and if they don't get it, they tend to take it personally. Okay. Uh, I wouldn't want them to take it personally. This isn't one of my uh, usual videos, so I'm not really sure how to proceed. But, um, it, it is a very nice, uh, pretty building. Uh-oh. I built it backwards, didn't I? Oh god, no, you, oh, you fool. I can't fix that, can I? Can I even fix that? Can I, can I even fix that? Can I connect it anywhere, please? Please, I, I goofed. Day one. Day one. Best let's play ever. I can tell, just like everybody else, I'm going to have... 500 episodes of this. Are you kidding? How do I? Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. Real genuine right here. Didn't see anybody else make that mistake. Oh, yeah. I can tell this is definitely my game. I'm j I just suck at it. Now what do I do? Replace on. Can I replace it? Can I? I I've got to replace it. I've got it. I've got it. Okay, can I get rid of that, please? Replace on, right? Ah. Uh, space, toggle curve, place back. No, I don't want to go back. I, I got to get rid of that. Unless, uh, what? Oh, toggle curve. Yeah, see, that's as close as I can get it. Oh man, yeah, I can't curve it around enough. I am screwball. Okay, so I literally just spent a bunch of money on a building that I put backwards. That is awesome. Um, can I, can I, can I rotate the, I mean, I guess it wouldn't be very re realistic if you could pick a building up and completely rotate it. Uh... I don't, I don't think I'm even getting all of that back. <laughs> oh, God. Okay. Let's try that again. I guess I... I just got off work, so I'm exhausted. Can't think straight. Okay, this time let's put it the right way around. So, the arrow connects towards the path. Oh god, now I gotta go all the way back around. Storms? Or a hurricane? Okay. Apparently we're doing that now. Camera shook. then so we got that built up and can I build anything else nope I need more power probably let's do it uh, that's like right next to a pre-existing power station can I maybe path not connected? Yes, I know. <clears throat> I've also been trying to... I don't know, I don't necessarily have a coal, but... Is this... Oh, okay, so there is another spot that I can put it. Maybe I should zoom out a little bit, see what my boundaries are. 
profit per minute. Uh, yeah, not making any of that. Not making any of that sweet, sweet profit, yo. Not yet, anyway. Let's try it around, like... Oh, uh, man, I just seen it there. Yeah. Okay. So, what do I do with these? Uh, it's 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 good. Uh, I I guess this is connecting it to the grid. I'm just guessing. Okay. Awesome. So let's get this thing connected so that we can start um, doing the thing, whatever that was. What was this building for again? Oh boy. Okay. Oh, I destroyed those trees. I killed the trees. Trees are dead. Uh, oh, oh, that'll work. Wait. No. Right there. That'll the work. The entertainment division is taking notice of your success. As your reputation increases with them, so too does the opportunity to tackle more challenging missions. I need more coffee. Um, research management. Okay. Help, island management. I'm Claire Deering. Whoa. And I've been on these islands before. On Isla Nublar, I made some mistakes and I've tried to set them right. I believe in what we're doing and I believe in these dinosaurs. Okay. Cool. The island management screen contains an overview of the key management elements of your islands. Responsible management of our animals is key as is creating a safe environment for our visitors. Okay. I can get down with that. Next, check your overall island rating, division reputations, and a summary of finances. And finally, you can also see mission progress and active contra contracts for the current island. Awesome. Uh, let's go... Hold on. Whoa. What did I do? Hey, oh, it's Isaac. How you doing? I got some cool Not stuff good. you need to be a part of, so I'm putting it out there. Come on and help the winning team. Mine. <laughs> Acquire 50% genome, Ceratosaurus. Reward is 100... 1 million? 1 million dollars, yes. Start mission? Sure, why not? I'm down for that. I'm down for whatever. What does that mean? It looks right. bad. It's red. I am all about the show. And with these dinosaurs, we have one unlike any other on the planet. Theme parks rely on drawing people in. And what is more attractive than new dinosaurs? Well, me, of course. <laughs> yeah, no, what I'm saying is let's get some fresh dinos in the hopper. Uh, okay. Oh, is that my power grid? Okay, so I can see my power grid to see... Requires path ah, ah path connection yes yes so the hey look I can even see where my dinosaurs moving around so this gives me how did I do that again just zooming out or did I hit this thing I hit that thing didn't I or did I just zoom out I gotta figure out how I did that because that's important that looks really good I can see literally everything uh, well there's the exit there but how did I do it I need to know how I did it. I, I, Retrace my step. That's, that's how I did it, apparently. Oh, it's letting me know one building is unconnected. That one there. Okay. So let's come on down. Let's come on down! Oh, thank God the coffee's finally starting to kick in. I'm waking up. I'm sorry. Sometimes I make these videos right after I get off work. Uh, let's get that path. That sweet, sweet, tasty path. Ooh, I can... Oh, look at these different paths. Oh, the dot. Oh, man. We can... Such diversity. I'm freaking out. <laughs> That's not bad. That's not bad. I'm, I'm glad they've got different paths. I, I literally... I think it was just the regular... Oh, cheap. Wait. Does that mean it costs money? I don't see a cost. Where's the cost? It does cost. Oh, we, we're going cheap. We're going cheap. <laughs> okay, so once to... Start. And the second to... Do the thing. 
I liked it better like this, I think. Whee! Let's keep the bush. Uh, how about... Why not? Awesome. Way to go, champ. You're getting power now. You're powering us up. I hope to God you are. So it's not giving me an alert at the top upper corner there to let me know any buildings are kafuggled, kafizzled, kafazzled. So did you guys go on that exploration yet? Are you searching for fossils? Fassels? Oh, well, An hello. expedition center will allow you to send dig teams I know! in search of new dino fossils. DNA can be extracted from these fossils, which our scientists can then turn into living, breathing dinosaurs. And that's our true lifeblood. Really? The dinosaurs are your true lifeblood? I thought it was the food. I, I honestly thought this whole place was a restaurant. I was mistaken. Okay, select dig site to start an expedition there with an available dig team. The expedition center will display an icon when it is ready to send out a dig team. Well, alrighty then. Oh, storm protection. Optional? Wait a minute. Obtain dinosaur fossils in amber by dispatching dig teams to sites around the world. How do you get storm protection? What, damaged? Path connection? Power required? Powered? Yes. Expeditions? Uh, view expedition map. It says operational, so have I just not selected a spot for them to start digging? And and not only that, but where am I at in the world? I can see the Great Lakes, so this is our actual physical world. Where is where is Island Mantanceros or wherever I'm at? Wait, wait, I bet it's in South America, because he said that Spanish was the language of choice. So I don't see where I'm at. I have no way of knowing that I know of. Or maybe, or maybe, and this is an even better theory, I'm just stupid. I go with that one. Dinosaurs. Genes, locations, archives, pathology, paleontology, dig sites. Ooh. Ooh, engine database. Okay, whoa, everything's blank. I don't know anything. I don't know a friggin' thing. Research, hello. Genetic research, new available. Hello. Damn it, okay. Oh, snakes. Sharks. <gasps> Can I make the megalodon? Oh, I shouldn't have done that. I didn't know I even clicked on something. I just wanted to see if it had megalodon stuff. Immune response, trait genes, research in progress. Okay, so. Does that make my dinosaur more immune to genes? Aggressive instincts, 1.0. Splicing this gene will increase the attack and defense traits pit viper DNA encourages offense as the best defense oh oh that makes my dinosaurs act differently I didn't even read what this one does okay so it's you're splicing genes in uh, intensive repair splicing this gene will increase the defense and resilience traits the properties of anola lizard DNA that regrows lost tails significantly significantly promote healthy tissue regeneration Hmm. Intuitive learning. Splicing this gene will increase the attack and resilience traits. Tests show crow DNA forming rapid neural connections in the brain. Okay. Da. Okay, boss. Whoa, island navigation. Oh, hey, look at that. You are here. Oh, Isla Muerta. Isla Sorna. Wait a minute. Isn't that where the... Isla Sorna presents the ultimate challenge for your operations in the Five Deaths. This was once a vast engine facility, but is now long abandoned. Refashioned the wild landscape and ruined infrastructure into the greatest facility yet. Is that the third one or the fourth one? Now I want to place them in all the movies. Isla Muerto is more hazardous island to run a successful facility on. I want to see the one that like was the big one, you know, the, the one from the first movie. Isla, Isla Nublar is the island where it all began. Yes! No, don't interrupt me. The new contract just came in. I think it's doable by you. Meh. Sure, why not? Ah, I didn't even read it. <clears throat> I'm an a-hole. I'll, I'll read it, I'll read it. Isla Nublar is the island where it all began. With both Jurassic Park and Jurassic World built here. Really? Oh, good God, you guys. It is up to you to succeed where others have failed before you in this sandbox. <laughs> oh. So none of them are five stars. Their uh, highest they go is four stars, as far as I can tell. 
That, that's a pretty high toughness there. It kind of makes me wonder though, how does it get more difficult? Does, do dinosaurs break in? Do the storms break the fences down and then you get fudged up? Okay, so I can extract DNA? Okay, and I heard that the higher the genome success rate, the better the success rate of you actually getting the, the DNA. Oh, God. To extract DNA from fossils and amber in order to create new dinosaur genomes. Exciting! I just said that, kind of, in a way, sort of. Okay, extract fossils to build genomes for each dinosaur. Variable genomes allow you to create dinosaurs at the Hammond Creation Lab. Expeditions sometimes bring back extra finds that can be sold for cash. Oh, yeah. Okay, what, what do we got here? Extraction slots available, six to six. Uh, we have a pretty good chance of extracting that, but uh, I already got one of those, right? Uh-oh, message. Oh, immune research complete. Awesome. Uh, bah. But I already got that guy. Does it mean any difference if I try to get another one? It's still there. Something new at the engine database. Nothing. Not a thing. Okay. I should really do some research on this. Uh, I, I don't even know if they're going for their uh, missions. Huh. I don't have any experience. I don't have a lot of experience with games like these. Whoa, management view, okay. Oh, interesting. Map. Ah, hey, that's an easy way to get to the map so that I can see what I'm doing. Whoa. Okay. So that's dinosaurs and vehicles in there. And exit the map. Okay, management views, enclosures, enclosures, excuse me. Operations. Okay, so... Uh, let's see. I'm not sure what all what all is going down now with the different plans and missions, uh, since it's pretty obvious that I have absolutely no idea what in God's name I'm doing. Uh, I think what I'll do is I'll take some of my own personal time out, maybe this weekend, and uh, keep trying the game and see if I can learn more about what's going on here, because uh, I I don't know anything about it. I I didn't get a chance to try it a month ago when all the other people were getting to play it because they got it um, you know early access because they're you know famous uh, and I'm not so I, I'm still learning about the game but it does seem really interesting uh, I know that you can have dinosaurs break out and I think you can have them fight and uh, you know I, I was gonna do a whole Jurassic Fight Club thing but you know I'm pretty sure I I wouldn't be the only one doing Jurassic Fight Club. There'd probably be like 30 or 40,000 others. Um, so I'll take some of my own personal time and learn some more about it. But it looks pretty interesting so far. Uh, and it's really nice. I, I, I like it. I like the idea of it. Um, so, yeah, that's. Uh, I don't know if I'll be doing any more videos of Jurassic uh, World because uh, uh, like uh, you know it's a sim game so I'm not sure how it's gonna go over um, uh, yeah, it's all it's all good it's all good I don't know where my little dino went um, I hope he's okay yeah there he goes uh, okie dokie so um, uh, let uh, Wow. Wow. Um, yeah. That's, uh, that's all for, uh, today. Uh, Jurassic Park World. Yeah. Uh, take it easy, my friends.